What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Jane, aka Prince, coming to you another video, and I got Sahithi. Let's go, y'all, boys and girls in the kingdom. Now, yeah. So today we are gonna go look at some apartments. We are going apartment shopping. I always love watching these videos on people's YouTube's because it gives me inspiration, and I'm finally doing it for myself. So right now we're about to go look at a two bed. Right now we're about to go look at a two bedroom and a three bedroom apartment. Um, they're both about five minutes away from each other. So we're about to go look because, you know, time moves extremely fast and I hate not being prepared for things. It feels like just yesterday I just dropped my first day of college vlog and now we're going into my senior year and next year I wanna try to get an apartment. I wanna, you know, I wanna, I wanna apply some pressure to myself and, you know, actually see it, you know? It's one thing to say and like, you know, say your goals but it's a one, another thing to see it and like touch it and like manifest it. That's why I always like going to car dealerships because you can actually sit in the car, you can feel it, you can hear it, you feel what I'm saying? So we're about to go look at these apartments and my cousin is actually gonna meet us up there. So it should be a fun experience and I want to bring you guys with me because I'm trying to get back into, you know, vlogging and stuff and I hope you guys like the new car vlog because obviously you guys see me in that big body bag with blue guts. I don't even think I showed this in the video but yes indeed, it got blue leather seats. So right now we're about to head out to Sandy Springs to go look at these apartments and yeah, I'm excited bro. I'm excited. I've always like dreamed about this day going to look at apartments. <laughs> so. If you're new to the channel, subscribe to the channel to the post notification if you're new. And let me know in the comments which ones you got that you guys like the most. We're gonna go look at two. So let's head up to the first unit. Alright, y'all. So first impressions. <clears throat> I really don't like the area too much. Oh. It's a one-way road right here. And I see a two-way road over here. But just like I don't know if you guys could really see that. Like it's cool, but I'm really not impressed. I don't remember if this is the two or three bedroom. <clears throat> the three bedroom was like 1600 and the two bedroom was uh, 13 or 1200. It's cool, it's, it's out the way. I don't know how I feel about like this, this area. But we only got one choice but to go look at it. So let's go look at it. So we're updating everything. Hi, Did they finish all 52 buildings then they'll go by each hand. Okay. Oh, so you mean like the bottom half being blue? Yeah, everything's supposed to be this color. Okay. Yeah, but they're yellow on oh, the hallways because okay. they're making them fire retardant. It's like type shit. This nigga's the same. All right. Welcome home. This is our 224 plan. Um, so with our three bedrooms, the one y'all are looking at, you have a, your living room will be bigger than this. Uh -huh. um, you did pick a floor unit. Um, we don't have the floor ones available right now. And you will have a fireplace in it. And then, so there's two, there's a washer and dryer located right here. Yours will be in the hallway. Uh -huh. And there, instead of them being the small barrels, so you're going to have a full size of barrel washer and dryer. Okay. All right. And if you open the fridge, there's snacks in there if y'all want to grab some. Oh, damn. So, so, as far as bedrooms go and the setup, so instead of having the two rooms right here, they're going to be down there on the end. And then there's going to be a big double door right here uh -huh. and that's going to be uh, one room that's going to be the room without a bathroom in it it's good um, this will work yes so your one of your bathrooms will look exactly like this and the other one will look similar to the one through the hall right oh in here oh this is nice so it wouldn't be this exact room but so. everything else is like consistent across the floor all of the rooms are about this size, so it's a smidge bigger than those rooms over here. Okay. Yeah, I think it's about 14,000 square feet in that room, too. Okay. What y'all thinking, man? Your closets will look similar to these ones right here. To the ones right here? Yeah. This, right here. this is a big ass closet. <laughs> No. This is a big ass closet. This is a big ass closet. And you said in the three bedroom, there'll be like. There'll be a third bedroom right here. Right here? Yeah, so they're basically they're right next to each other. Oh, uh, yeah, all three rooms are real close to each other. So it's not like y'all on the other side of the house. Type shit. Okay. What's the. Oh, you don't have a three bedroom family. Coat closet. Yeah, the one that comes available next week, I think we'll go on Friday. Okay. Um, every apartment will also have a patio as well. Yes, the two that we have available right now on the first floor. 
This is not bad though. Excellent. Yeah, I don't like it to wash it, right? But this is in the um three, the three oh. two, they're gonna be in the hallway. Okay. And they're gonna be the full size wash and dryer. And those are the little barrels for the kitchen. Yeah, we bought this property in 2020 and there were no washers and dryers anywhere. So we went back and retrofitted um, them in all of our units except for two. So it's $95 per adult that lives in the unit. And then it's $150 reservation fee. Uh, if you are not approved, you get the 150 back. If you are approved, then you have 24 hours to change your mind before that's gonna be, uh, that goes to your administrative fees. The 150 will go to my- Administrative fees. Okay, and then our, for qualifying, we ask that you have three times the base rent. We do a background check and then uh, do rental and employment verification. We don't have no pets, so that's cool. Mm -hmm. If you decide to get a dog, we have a dog park. Oh, we have like our own Balcony vibe. Can I open this? I'm gonna leave that alone. All right, y'all. So we just left the first unit. Um, shout out to our tour guide. She was actually cool as hell. But um, we are currently about to go to the second location. And I want you guys to let me know what you guys think about that first location. Like, what'd you guys think? Um, it was cool, but the location was I wasn't ideal. It does look a little outdated from the outside, but she did say that that um they are repainting everything and getting everything ready because I think they are making the buildings uh, fire retarded. That's her words, not mine. Let me know what you guys think. I don't think it's worth sixteen hundred in my opinion. The only thing that I would say I did like was how all the bedrooms are right next to each other. Like they're literally as soon as you walk in, it's one, two, three on the left side of the um the room i don't really like that um i would like it for it to be a little bit spaced out even if it's two rooms next to each other and then one on the other side of the unit i feel like that'd be a little bit better um and the two and the two two the washer dryer were in the kitchen don't know how i feel about that uh but we were looking we were trying to look at the three two so let me know in the comments what you guys think about that unit i give that one like a 6.7 out of 10 it was cool but it didn't really you know what I mean? I like that it had all new appliances. I like that it's out the way, but I think it's a little too far out the way. Um, it's two exits away from Alpharetta. You know what I mean? Um, it's Fulton County, but like border of Fulton County. If you're from Georgia, you know exactly what I'm talking about. I just didn't, I didn't like that. So let me know in the comments what you guys think. We're about to go to the second unit um, and see what that one is hitting on. And I'll let you guys know when we get there. Brr! All right, so we just posted to the second apartment complex, and I like this one a whole lot better just, just by the walk-in. The leasing office just looks a whole lot more, like, modern. The apartments look a little bit better. It looks a little bit more homey to me. So, it really got a plus one just, just off the drive-in. I like how it's surrounded by trees so you guys can't see inside. I fought with this. This is giving apartment home vibes. But, that's just the first part. We're about to go in there and get our tour, and... Hopefully the tour talks nice. Hopefully we can find our dream home today. So let's get into it. All right, y'all, this is the second unit. This is the kitchen. I got a lot of space in here. I like this. I like when you can see from the kitchen. You feel what I'm saying? I like this. We got gas, everything, new appliances. Dishwasher. As soon as you walk into the right, coat closet, I'm sure, yup. Fireplace, got a good sized everything. You can put a kitchen table right here. Ooh, washer and dryer, bathroom, good size bathroom too. And then right here is the master, I wanna say. Nah, I don't think this is the master. This ain't big enough to be a master, but this also has a balcony, as you guys can see. And the balcony has space out there, which is what she showed us. And it's just what I was talking about. Like, you can, I don't, I like that people can't see into your shit. You feel what I'm saying? So boom, it's a decently big closet. And this is the master. This is the master bedroom? Nah, this one right here is the master bedroom. Got a closet, walk-in closet, good size space. I wish it was a little bit bigger, but can't really complain. Then you look at here, bathroom, master bathroom, vibes. I actually like this. This is decently, you know what I'm saying? It's a two bedroom. This is nice, I like this though. She said they have a sister, um, a 
sister company that has like lofts and like the two floor apartments, which is what I want one day. If I ever get an apartment, I want a two floor apartment. But you see the balcony, step out here, quick show y'all. Bow, movie. I like that nobody can see into your shit. You feel what I'm saying? You got some storage space over here. All right, bro, good talk. And this is nice stuff. This is fire, I like this. So, yeah, that is unit number two. Let me know in the comments which one do you guys like more. I have so you guys know I like this one. I just like the living room, but look at the living room. The living room is such a vibe. Fireplace. You got the kitchen with like the, I don't know what this is called, like when you can see through I'm the. Mad music and shit right now. Word, but you can. Yeah, word. The, the walls are definitely thin as fuck. Type shit. <laughs> Going from looking at apartments to seeing these houses, like these big ass houses over here in Sandy Springs. It's like Sandy Springs slash Dunwoody. Like, it just makes you like, be like, why the fuck would I even go buy an apartment anyway? You get what I'm saying? Like, why would I go do that when I could go get some fire shit and have the fucking basketball court in my driveway? You get what I'm saying? That's why I don't know, bro. Like, I want an apartment, but like, I want some shit that's mine. Like, like you can own a townhouse. I'd rather own a townhouse than pay somebody else's rent you feel what I'm saying when you when you really like like look look at that shit like would you rather not even though you know that's out of the budget of course but like for 15 1600 bro you can go get a, a smooth crib and you can own that shit and then you can pass that shit to your kids and then your kids can pass that down to their kids and you just creating generational like you feel what I'm saying they're paying fifteen hundred dollars for a two-bedroom apartment and you paying somebody else's rent really so I don't know, bro. Um, I have a lot to think about, but I do like the second unit a lot, but I just don't think it's also worth $1,600 or it was like 17 after everything. Um, so I don't know. If you need your chance, subscribe to your channel, start posting in case you're new. I don't know where this vlog is gonna go, but I just have to say that because like, he got the fucking basketball court in his driveway. And we pay 1700 for a two bedroom three bedroom that you can't own in 15 months 10 months 12 months six months you got to move out